Hey everybody, it's Mark from the Geek Church, and today we're going to be um, doing a product review of something we haven't really done before, a wallet. Now, technically that's not really a gadget, I mean, there's no real electronics stuff involved, but I'm pretty sure electronics maybe made it, so um, yeah, that's something. Anyway, this is from a company called Aurox, and that's spelled A-U-R-O-C-H-S. And you know what? Um, honestly, I had never really heard of that. Apparently that is an extinct species of cattle. So um, basically, I'm not really sure what that has to do with it, but it is pronounced Orox. I did a pronunciation thing because honestly, I just do my research like that. I'm thoroughly a great researcher. Anyway, this particular thing came to me like this. As far as I know, this envelope or whatever this is, is not really a product they have. It actually kind of confused me when I saw this thing and then I looked on the website. I actually, since I'm a thorough researcher, I contacted the company and said, hey guys, uh, what is with this envelope thing? And they said, oh, they just, it just comes with it. And it's like, okay. I don't know if this is made of the genuine leather. That is, this envelope is made of the genuine leather that is the product inside, which is what I'm going to be highlighting today. But, uh, oh, I don't know if you can see that, but... Uh, the logo is there, but it's very faint, and my webcam isn't really picking it up. This isn't going to be one of those my usual uh, reviews from the studio, and um, yeah, stuff is harder to pick up than... Uh, I'm not even sure if the studio could get this thing. It's very faint, but it is there. Uh, just go to myorox.com. You can see what their products are. But uh, let's get to the product itself. This is the space, the final... Okay, that was a... That was, come on. You, it's called a space. What joke would you have made? I don't know. Um, space 1999. Okay, maybe if this is 1999, that would have worked. But we're in 2020, and that's a whole new set of jokes right there. <laughs> so, anyway, this is the long wallet. As you can see, it is a wallet, and it is long. Uh, no big surprise there. Uh, the one thing that you can do with this thing is you can actually uh, stuff. Yeah, here's what it looks like on the inside. You got room for about eight to 10 uh, credit cards uh, in here. And plus you can stuff all kinds of things in that. In fact, the pocket is big enough so you can stuff your smartphone in there, which I think is kind of cool. So this might be a good thing for the ladies. I'm not really certain if, I think I looked, it's like a design with women in mind. But I mean, for guys, I've, actually, honestly, I don't really have a pocket that, maybe a breast pocket I could fit this in, but seriously, it's pretty, it's pretty good. I'm not sure if this is unisex or not, but um, this is what you're getting into. So like uh, my backpack reviews, I'll show you the pocket and another pocket with the pocket. Pocketception. Yeah, I don't know how to do that black and white thing. So Peter was really good at that, doing that. So that's what we've got for you today. Anyway, so it's got uh, that much room and this is, I'm told, genuine leather. So it feels pretty good on the hands. I'm also told this is RFID scanner proof, and I don't really have a chance to really test that out, but I'm going to have to just sort of take its word for it. Anyway, you can get this uh, space long wallet in uh, black. I believe this is the black one um, because it comes in green and brown, and this looks neither green nor brown. Color might be a little bit off on my recording, but hey, uh, this looks like the black kind, and... Um, it's about uh, $109.99, and it's a pretty decent product. So I'll have to give it a good review, and um, that'll be all for today. And this is Mark Rollins from the Geek Church, signing off.